Welcome to a new school year, Mohawks. We've got a virtual open house for you. Give me just a second to share my screen. All right, here we go. The 2021 school year. These are your um, teachers and principals this year. We've got Mr. Conley over here. He's the sixth grade um, assistant principal. And Mrs. Green is our guidance counselor. And in just a second, we're gonna see all of the teachers on the Mohawks team this year. I'm Mrs. Noriega. I teach um, civics and economics. I'm also the team leader. I've been teaching for a few years and I went to school at JMU and ODU and I love to read and I love to sing and I love to dance. I've got two little girls and a husband and I'm so excited for this new school year. Um, I want to tell you a little bit about our virtual schedule. You're going to be getting a schedule in the mail, and you'll also be able to see it on um, student view. And you'll get it in your regular one through seven bell schedule. But you've got to switch it around and figure out how that's going to work out virtually. So if you take a look, you'll see on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, you're going to have live instruction with math, English, um, Core Plus, and PE. Then on Tuesday and Thursday, you're going to have instruction live with civics, science, core plus again, and whatever your other elective is. So for example, if you take a look here on the left in our traditional schedule, where you'd start off the day in bell one in English, um, and then you take a look at the virtual schedule to the right, you'll start off in English on Monday, Wednesday, Friday at 8.55. On Tuesday, Thursday, you won't meet with your English teacher live, but you'll have English work to do during that time. Then your Bell 2 class is going to fit on Tuesday, Thursday. That'll be science. You'll meet twice a week with your science teacher. You'll notice that Core Plus is a class that meets every day. Another teacher is going to tell you what that is in just a minute. And then it follows through the schedule. Um, if you take a look at the bottom, you'll notice that yellow means that you're in class you're live and you've got to check in with the teacher that day. We're going to be sending home a link where you can take your schedule and put it into this virtual schedule like I have done. Hi, I'm Ms. Ewers and I'm the science teacher on the Mohawk team. I graduated from ODU and this is my 30th year teaching, my eighth year at Hickory Middle School. I'm married, um, I have a daughter who's also a teacher, and we live in Kitty Hawk, North Carolina. I enjoy gardening and camping and reading and going to the beach. And I'm look, looking forward to working with you guys this year on the first day of school. Um, I'm gonna talk to you about Core Plus. Core Plus is a bell that you will have every day, and it's going to be bell three for you. It is not a graded class, so some of the things that we do in Core Plus are team building, and you can see a list on the, on the screen of some of the things that we do in Core Plus. As the year goes on, it may become a flexible um, grouping where you might meet with different teachers in Core Plus to do things like enrichment or project-based learning, remediation, whatever you need. But we start out the year pretty much we'll do character, we'll talk about what the expectations are for our classrooms and for online learning. Hi, I am Mrs. Quick and I'm the English teacher. Um, I graduated from the University of North Florida in Jacksonville, Florida with a bachelor's in finance and from Old Dominion University with a master's of education. Um, we're a longtime submarine family and have been stationed many places throughout the United States. Uh, we have two boys that will be attending Hickory Middle this year with me. This is my third year at Hickory Middle. Um, we really enjoy traveling and hiking national parks as a family. And I'm super excited to get to see all your smiling faces soon.
So here at Hickory Middle, we SOAR the hallway. Um, SOAR is an acronym. S is for safety. O is for ownership. A is for attitude. And R is for respect. I know this is a lot of information to take in right now in this matrix. Um, we will be reviewing this with the students during our core class, during our third bell. So absences and makeup work. Um, we are required to take attendance. The district has stated that the attendance will include um, attending a teacher-led learning session, maybe like on Zoom, um, collaborating with a teacher one-on-one -on -one or in a small group during teacher office hours, uh, submitting an independent learning activity or an assessment or participation in an online discussion within Schoology, communicating with the teacher via email, video conferencing, or a phone call. Um, we realize that there will be days that you will have appointments and you may miss a bell or two, or you may not be feeling well, you may miss the whole day. Uh, all the assignments will be posted in Schoology, so we just ask that you complete your makeup work as soon as possible. And if you have any questions or concerns, please reach out, contact the individual teacher. Hi Mohawks, my name is Mrs. Wallace and I'm the math teacher for the team this year. Um, I have my bachelor's and master's degrees from Old Dominion. This is my 30th year teaching and my first year as a Hawk, so I'm really excited to be here at Hickory Middle School. I am married and I have two sons. I'm going to go over the, the um, grades with you. Um, parents, you have access to parent view. Students have access to student view, which is Synergy. Please check that weekly. Grades will be uploaded there. Also, students will be required to go on to Schoology to submit their work. Any missing assignments, they'll need to go on and look and see what's on there and needs to be completed. Our grade scale is as follows. Tests and projects will be weighted 40% of the grade. Quizzes are 30%. And the practice is 30%. Practice is homework, classwork, assignments that aren't quizzes or tests. Um, expect homework. Obviously, as the schedule was stated, there will be off days where students will still be going on doing work and submitting assignments on Schoology. And I'm looking forward to a wonderful school year. I know we're starting off virtually, but we got this. It's going to be great. Hey, Mohawks, my name is Mrs. Siri, and I guess you could call me the learning specialist on the team. I've got my bachelor's degree and master's degree from Old Dominion University. This is my 21st year teaching and my sixth year at Hickory Middle School. Um, I'm married, I have three kids. One of them will be at Hickory Middle with me. One's at Hickory High and one graduated this past year. When I'm not here, I like spending a lot of time outdoors. That's where you can find me. So I'm gonna talk about school supplies. Now, we know that lots of your assignments are gonna be done virtually, but you still will have to write things down. Um, so we're asking that you have one three to five subject spiral notebook handy to be able to do all the things that you need to write down. And you can't write that down without your pencil pouch. So make sure you have your pencil pouch all ready to go, filled with pencils, erasers, a handheld pencil sharpener, because you don't want to have to try to scramble to find something to sharpen your pencil with. Pens, highlighters, tri erase marker, glue stick, scissors, you never know what you're going to need, so it's always best to be prepared. I look forward to seeing everybody very soon. Let's talk about the first day of school and what that's going to look like. We're all looking forward to that Tuesday, September 8th. And Ms. Noriega talked to you earlier about your schedule. You'll receive that in the mail. But we will go over it with you the first day of school. So if you have any questions about it or you're not sure who you meet with and how you get into your Zoom meetings, we'll go over all of that with you on the first day of school. The first day of school, you will see your science and your civics teacher. And um, then you'll have math and you'll see your math and English teacher on Wednesday. Um, set alarms for your Zoom meetings. That would be a great idea because it's gonna be a lot to keep up with. And don't be afraid to ask questions. Communication is so important. And relax, it's sixth grade. We're all learning new things this year, which is exciting. We're lifelong learners. We'll figure it out. We got this. 
All right, great. Thanks very much for watching our video. We're looking forward to meeting you and seeing you online on Tuesday, September 8th, and hopefully sometime real soon in the building. See you soon. Bye-bye. Bye, guys.